I think that the, the importance of location intelligence uh, comes in uh, from, from many from many ways. On, on the one on the one hand, um, location intelligence is creating operational efficiencies into different established businesses. We can name uh, telco operators, we can name banking, insurance, logistics companies, governments, smart cities, um, retailers. Uh, th there's so many verticals that are getting more efficient uh, due to uh, location intelligence. And at the same time, uh, it's, it's creating an ecosystem of uh, innovators or, or, or startup companies uh, with coming up with new ideas, okay, that are also uh, adding value to, to the to the economy. I was uh, in in Australia recently, and, and I came across that some of our partners that were shops specialized in uh, in location and GIS and, and GIS consulting. They had been acquired by, by, by bigger companies like more engineering firms, generic engineering firms. Th that, that trend is happening and, and from a financial point of view I think the, the best way to justify this trend is the fact that location industries are outperforming other industries in terms of growth. Okay, so more sluggish or more established companies that are, have a more stable business uh, business model or business, they want to grow faster. So that's why they're acquiring uh, location-related companies because they are outperforming. Visualization is it, it, it's, it's very it's becoming more and more important. I mean, and they are so many cases of, of companies growing high pace and, and getting funding at high pace that are just in the visualization space, right? When big BI uh, tools and, um, and even consulting firms just creating visualizations. Uh, I think they are important because they help business managers to tell a story. And business managers, they, they have so many things in mind uh, and they don't have to, uh, time to go to the exact numbers. They, they need to. They, they need some visualization that in, in one second they are able to to see what is happening there. They can iterate. They can zoom in. They can find the insight. Okay, uh, in, in a fast way. Okay, and visualizations in general and map, of course, is just one type of visualization, right? Which is the one related to to geospatial. My, in terms of um, advertising maps, I mean, I think two angles. On the one hand, I think maps are, are, are becoming like a, like a brand name. It seems like if you go to a website and you don't see a map, you don't, you don't see where the assets related to that company uh, are, it seems like there's something fishy. There's, there's no connection to the real world. I, I think that's more like a, uh, an interpretation, uh, emotional interpretation maybe. And then uh, in advertising, maps and location uh, intelligence is also important because it's helping advertisers uh, understand what's happening with the advertising uh, they, are, they are having, uh, to understand the, 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 the conversion rates that are taking place when they, when they print an, a, an ad. And, and they are also helping them to, to, to see what type of ad they should place and depending on the target audience and depending on the location of, of that particular uh, billboard or that particular ad display, whatever ad display, whatever ad display. So uh, in this space, yeah, I think this, these are the, the, the two main importances that I see in uh, of location or maps in, in advertising. The trends, at least in, in, the, in the short term, I think one of the trends is democratization of, of maps and, and not only maps, or maps in an extended map where you have maps and analysis and, and, and widgets and, and analytics. Uh, that, that's been democratized and more and more is being used in businesses. Uh, there, there's some surveys that, that we usually use that say that the number of organizations using location intelligence is going to double in the next uh, few years and the number of staff using location intelligence within organization is also going to double. So we're talking about a, a quadruple growth. The democratization is one of the, the legs of the future of, of location intelligence. And then I see it more augmented reality mixed with maps and, and also for, for video cameras, uh, tracking people into the geospatial space. So I see a lot of uh, convergence between, between location technologies and, and, and artificial intelligence.